Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I'm pleased now to yield uh, one minute to the chairman of the Oversight Subcommittee on Energy and Commerce, the gentleman from Pennsylvania, Mr. Murphy. The gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you. Right before the 4th of July, the administration admitted the Affordable Care Act wasn't ready. As we just heard from the other side of the aisle, the bill is a burden. And so they waived the mandate tax for employers, but not the American people. The White House says, remain calm, all is well, but there's many signs the law is not ready. The Small Business Health Insurance Exchange, delayed. In states that don't expand Medicaid, well, we're going to delay the mates for some. Uh, for some insurance rates, they'll rise 90 to 400 percent. And if you want to qualify for subsidies, they tell us you don't have to tell the uh, truth in your paperwork because no one's going to check. Don't force Americans to be taxed on something they don't want and is not ready. They told us we had to pass the bill in order to find out what's in it, and now they're telling Americans you have to buy the policy to find out what's in it or else be taxed. Be fair, delay the mandate tax for employers and the American people. I yield back. The gentleman from Pennsylvania yields back. The gentleman from Georgia Reserve.